Hello guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you this 2020 Nissan Versa. This one is the SR trim and I'm going to be showing you the interior and exterior lighting of this 2020 Nissan Versa. So coming to the headlight of this 2020 Nissan Versa, this one is the SR trim. So it will have LED daytime running light, LED high and low beam, but the uh, turn signal and the fog lights are actually going to be uh, halogen. But let me go ahead and turn on the low beam so you guys could see how it looks like. So I just turned on the low beam and the low beam is actually pretty bright. Um, the low beam actually sits in three reflectors and the high beam is actually in one reflector. Uh, but the light quality looks really good. Let me go ahead and turn on the high beam so you guys see how the high beam and the low beam looks together. So I just turned on the high beam and that's how the high beam looks like with the low beam. Uh, looks pretty bright. So let me go ahead and turn on the fog lights so you guys see how it looks like. So I just turned on the fog lights and the fog lights are actually halogen on this SR trim. Uh, the fog lights will actually turn off if you have your high beams on, but they will turn back on if you have your low beam on. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how the lights look like. I have the fog lights and low uh, beams turned on now. If I turn on the high beams, you'll see more light shining right here. But if I turn off the uh, high beam, you will see the fog lights and low beams. I'm going to go ahead and turn off the fog lights. And the fog lights are actually completely off now with just only the low beams. So coming to the back of this uh, Versa, actually in the back here, nothing is LED. Everything is actually halogen. Uh, the tail lights, turn signals, and the reverse lights are actually halogen. And even the uh, plate uh, lights are actually uh, halogen. Nothing in the back here is LED, which is expected for a cheap car that is actually under 20,000. So let me go ahead and show you the trunk trunk is actually not that bright but uh, there is a good amount of light actually everywhere and it's covering the whole trunk uh, but the actual light itself is actually not that bright so right here inside the Versa I've noticed something on the window switches. The only window switch that is actually that has a light on it is the driver one. The other window switches do not have any lights. I'm not exactly sure why uh, Nissan did this. I wish they actually put lights on all the window switches. Uh, I think this is pretty cheap uh, on Nissan's side. But coming to the uh, steering wheel, everything is actually nice and lit. And uh, everything has a really good brightness to it. Of course, you have your Bluetooth controls here and you have your cruise control but coming to the gauges gauges are actually uh really easy to read the lights are actually really good and um, everything looks really good so i really like what nissan did with, with this versa uh, so the lights are actually really good in the interior of this versa right here to the uh, screen everything is easy to read and the lights are actually uh pretty bright climate control and coming down to the uh, engine stop start Everything looks uh, really good and I like uh, the interior of this uh, Nissan Versa. So turning on the lights, the lights are actually pretty bright. They're just uh, halogen and uh, they actually are doing a great job uh, making the interior of this Versa very, very bright. I'm actually impressed with the light. Uh, it is aiming uh, toward my eyes a little bit, but other than that, actually, the light is actually covering everything in this interior, and I really actually like that. Everything is well lit, and even the ground, there is basically light everywhere, and I only have those two lights on. So for the visors, the visors actually do not have lights in them. I wish they did, but again, this is a $19,000 car. Uh, I like the fact that actually this one has an extension right here, but... I'm really, really impressed with the uh, amount of light that is covering everything right here. So let me go ahead and hop in the back and show you the back of this Versa. And then I'll go ahead and finish the video right there. So coming to the back seat light, the back seat light is actually not as strong as the front one. And I'm honestly really impressed with the uh, brightness of the front uh, two lights. But there is a good amount of light back here. And uh, I'm just really impressed and shocked with how bright 
the two lights are actually are but guys that's it for this video i hope you guys liked uh, this uh, quick uh interior and exterior view at night of this uh new versa um i would actually like to thank david for helping me out and providing me with this car and i would actually like uh, to thank uh, heart nissan uh, for uh, making this happen so that's it for this video guys i hope you guys liked it and if you guys did please subscribe and as always i'll see you next time